Dog has released a study that's causing concern about the safety of what's a staple food for many, instant noodles. The Consumer Council found potentially cancer-causing chemicals in nearly 90% of the instant noodles it tested. The names of these potential carcinogenic contaminants are 3-MCPD and glycidol. The Consumer Council says the substances were detected in 17 of the 19 prepackaged fried and non-fried instant noodles it tested, along with seasoning packets and toppings sold with the items. These three products that come with seasonings containing palm oil were found to have levels of contaminants that exceed European Union limits for the relevant vegetable oils. These two were found to contain 3,100 micrograms per kilogram of 3-MCPD. EU regulations for palm oil have set a maximum limit of some of 3-MCPD and its fatty acid esters at 2,500 micrograms per kilogram. The brand of instant noodles here had 5,111 micrograms per kilogram of glycidol in its seasoning. That's over five times the EU's maximum levels for the contaminant in general edible vegetable oil. So what are these contaminants? 3-MCPD has been classified as a possible human carcinogen and glycidol as a genotoxic experimental animal carcinogen by the International Agency for Research on Cancer. Neither Hong Kong nor the EU has set out maximum limits for the detected levels of either contaminant in instant noodles or their seasonings. And there is no scientific research that has found a link between consumption of instant noodles that contain these chemicals and increased risk of cancer. But in its report, the Consumer Council said, Although normal consumption of these seasonings does not pose significant risks to the health of adults, the Council urges manufacturers to use ingredients with fewer contaminants to improve product safety and safeguard consumer health. The companies that make or distribute the instant noodles in question have responded to the report. Meadows Noodles says its products fulfill Hong Kong's regulations, but it has already removed the suspect items from shelves and pledged to improve the quality of what it makes from now on. The maker of Mami says the level of 3-MCPD and glycidol found in its products meet the standards under the harmful substances in food regulations and the joint FAO-WHO Expert Committee on Food Additives, among others. In addition to the two potential carcinogenic contaminants, the Consumer Council also detected excess levels of sodium, ranging from 1,509 to 2,477 milligrams. The World Health Organization's recommended adult intake limit for sodium is 667 milligrams per meal, and it suggests adults should consume less than 2,000 milligrams of sodium per day. The Council advised people not to consume too much sodium since excessive amounts over extended periods may lead to increased risk of heart and renal diseases.